and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I have a huge Glassons haul for you. These are all my favorite pieces and they're so super trendy. This haul is screaming Pinterest aesthetic. Without further ado, let's just jump right into this video. Look at this gorgeous faux leather jacket I managed to pick up. She is stunning. I'm going to be trying this jacket on later in the video, but I just wanted to give you a sneaky peek of how cute it is and like how vibey this haul is going to be. All right, the first thing that I'm showing you is this really cute top. So a while ago, I filmed a letting the filter decide if I should get curtain bangs or not. Editing me here. I just wanted to jump on here and say thank you so much because this video got over 100,000 views. I cannot believe it. That is my most viewed video ever. Anyway, let's just jump right back into the video which i let them out in this video it's catherine with bangs and a lot of people are asking where i got the top in the video from it is a really lovely top from glasses it's super cropped i love the scoop neck on this my biggest struggle with scoop neck tops is that this wide bit here is too wide so it goes all the way here and then i find it really hard to wear a bra underneath and i like to wear stuff underneath i'm not like a free shower so i'm really happy with the cut of this top it's a little bit thick as well like my top is in see-through. It's just really flattering and perfect to chuck on with jeans, cargo, skirts, anything. I'm also trying a different kind of aesthetic out in this video and I'm really excited to show you guys because I am in love with this new kind of look. I've been skeptical to try it and I'll tell you why but yeah this is the first item and also these jeans which I show you in probably like every one of my videos. You cannot go wrong with a really good mid-rise straight leg jean. Let's go to the second one. Next thing is this really cool mesh top. It is so pretty. It's a little bit see-through, but it's totally fine because I got a cute black crop top that I can wear underneath this and it just looks so cool. I also really like the asymmetric kind of detail on this thing. Let me put it on for you because you guys are going to love it. This is a cute little knit bralette that I got to go under this top. Got my third arm. No, I'm joking. All right. So this is the mesh top on. I love this like ombre sunset print it is just so gorgeous and it really spices up the top it like funks it up a little which is like mwah. you can totally dress it up for like night vibes or you can dress it down for like a more casual I also really like the layering effect with the bralette underneath I wouldn't ever wear it just by itself because that is just like a big no for me like that's too risque experimenting with mesh to fully complete this outfit this is what I was thinking when I got this top is to pair it with this gorgeous denim maxi skirt this is the skirt that i was telling you guys about that i was like not too sure like it's a new aesthetic for me to try because i never wear long skirts i'm always like a short skirt person because i feel like it just elongates my legs and being a short girly i don't like things that would make me look shorter than usual so i was a bit nervous to pick out this denim maxi but what sold me was this slit in the middle i really like that effect because i I think this would be the major slay moment when you can wear boots underneath and it would just look so cute. Imagine some knee high cream or black boots like that would just be a vibe that is screaming it girl and I love that. I'm so so excited to style this for more like winter-ish weather. What I love about this skirt is that it's not high rise. You know me if you watch my stuff if you've been a subscriber of mine for a while you know I don't like high rise things. This skirt sits just where my belly button is and it's so so comfy on. I I love this little leg split moment and it's actually all the way down to my ankles so it's super maxi on me but it's the perfect length so it's not dragging on the ground. How like, cute is this fit right now? What do you think of the first like proper outfit? The next item is this really cute white cropped top. It's a bit of a like a ribbed fabric but it's like scratchy-ish. I mean it's really comfy on and it's not itchy but it's like a bit rough. I love the cut of this because I find like it's really flattering and I really like these bells sleeves i like how they're wider at the ends because they just look longer and they add a little bit more of a kick to your outfit it's also just a really nice classy kind of item and it's a bit more of an elevated basic because of the 
sleep moment. This item I thought was really funky and it's giving like more street style vibes. This knitted vest, it's a zip up one and I love how it's got this zip detailing because it just breaks it away from your basic knit. And I really like the color, it's just really autumn. This is the vest on, you can zip it all the way up to the neck and it's really warm. How funky is this? You can unzip it and fold the collar down. It could be really, really cute layered. So if you have a nice white long sleeve on underneath, put this over the top and you'll be warm and cute. Oh my God, guys, outfits are coming into my head. The ideas are flowing. Next up is this cropped sweater. How many times have we seen this sweater? You tell me because I have featured it in quite a lot of my videos. I love it so much. Warm, it's soft, and it's very flattering on the bod. I love how cropped it is and the v-neck. It's so cute. You can style it with like jeans or a skirt, mini skirt or maxi skirt as I now have. I'm so happy I got that maxi skirt added to my wardrobe. So you've seen this all in the white, but have you seen it in this other color? I also got the knit in this gorgeous turquoise blue. It's like giving icy blue. I, for one, love how it looks with these jeans, like giving an all blue vibe. I also think it can be so, so cute with like a nice mini skirt and leg warmers because that is giving ballet call. Do you guys remember the TV show on ABC? and it was called Angelina Ballerina and they all had their ballet outfits with the different color ribbons. Oh my god, I loved that show to bits. That show had me in a chokehold when I was younger. I wanted to be a ballerina so bad, but I do not have the coordination or the flexibility. This sweater is reminding me of the blue ballerina with the blue ribbon. I'm gonna be super typical. My favorite was Angelina with the pink ribbon. And I remember I made my mum get like a stick and tie a pink ribbon, nice thick one, on the end and I'd go around the house swirling it and like try to be a ribbon ballerina. I miss those days. If you guys have watched that show when you were younger, let me know in the comments below. All right. This next top is something really, really different. It's so funky. Lassen's always kills it with their corsets. I personally love this one so much because it is a really nice velvety fabric. It's got this lace up bit here and this eyelet detailing on the chest area. Look at me trying to be all fancy and like fashion-y, describing a top in fashion terms. In this corset, it's actually got the boning. And I love the cut, the sweetheart cut is just so flattering on my body shape. I actually got this top to wear to a very exciting event I have coming up. It's the launch of some boots from this really big shoe company in Australia. And I wanted to wear this, but I wanted to dress it up. So I was thinking maybe a collared white cropped long sleeve underneath. So it's giving like layered edgy. That's my thought process for this top. I've been doing and filming the one young workout challenge. So can anyone see any ab improvements? This next item is this cute gray turtleneck top. It's a nice stretchy material and it's light. It's not super thick, but that's what I love about it. It's so comfy and it's actually really nice and warm. I have been getting into my grays lately. They're just a really cute autumn winter color. And I got the matching skirt. I love the folded down vibe and how it's like flowy and not cut like a super strict A-line. It's really vibey. And if you just layer it with a nice black leather bomber, and leg warmers and loafers, which that is how I styled it. And I'll show you guys here. It also reminds me of the Frankie's bikini knit range, I'm gonna say. But this one's like a good dude. Next up is this really cute dress. Look at the gorgeous bluey detail and the ribbon and the ruffles on the shoulder. It's like farm girl vibes, but with a twist. But also you could make it more like city chic. It is so flattering. I love how it hugs the upper body and then has a little looser moment down there. This chest area is so cute. The ruffles make it look so sweet. It's kind of like a mesh dress, but it's layered. So you cannot see anything. Don't you stress a little funny thing, but I also got a beret. I have been seeing this on Instagram and they just look so cute. I feel like accessories can really elevate an outfit. Oh, 
Is this how you wear it? Is it giving? I'm not too sure how to wear it. I've got to do some more research, but I thought this beret would be a little bit of fun to experiment with and play around for the autumn winter season. I've got to figure out how to wear this without looking like a funny little thing. Lastly, the item you've all been waiting for is this gorgeous leather jacket. Let me just show you the detailing like up close. I love this colored effect so much and the zippers are real. In my eyes, it kind of gives off like a really dark brown color, but on the side it says washed black but i'm saying brown they managed to create that vintage leather jacket really well and i just live for the detailing like the detailing on the sleeves is also so cute and watch this guys when you zip it up it is also a major slay moment this is the jacket zip i find it really cute and it's a really nice length too so it's not cropped on me but if i wanted to be cropped i can tuck it in this is a really great alternative way to wear the jacket and just make it look a little different as well what are your thoughts on the jacket let me know down in the comments. All right, you guys. That brings my super trendy glasses haul to an end. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know which one was your favorite item. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.